Hello guys, it's me Carl Santos, aka Epicardo 957 or 095 <laughs> and welcome to a game I haven't done in a while or haven't reviewed in a while so it's NASCAR Heat 5 So, basically, I'm doing two races today, Chicago Man and Indianapolis, so, oh, where can I start? Chicago Man, I qualified mediocre, and then throughout the race, I just was buying my time, trying to get to the lead, I believe, in this Xfinity Series race, and I'm not gonna tell you the ending. <laughs> you know that what'll happen when I say that, but there I am, 17th. Qualify 17th. Let's see who's on the pole. Harrison Burton. Harrison Burton's on the pole, so. And then there's Riley Herbs, I believe. And look for the story of the race. And, yep. I guess Danny and Emmerich was sent to the back, so. Let's get the show on the way at Chicago Lane. And the green flag is out. And I haven't done like a review of a race at that. On NASCAR Heat 5 in a while, so it's gonna take me a while to figure out what I'm doing in traffic and how to maneuver the slow cars. So, let me fix my uh, laptop. There, I am. there it is. So, I'm up in 13th so far, trying to pass Justin Allgaier for another position, which is 12. And as far as I can say, Ooh, man. Getting under Ross Chastain. <laughs> that was a solid move, I'm telling you. And now I can say I can go on the bottom and pass guys. Ooh. Man, that was out. Anthony Alfredo there. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, I just let them by because... They have good short run speed, I believe, and... Still there. Okay... Yeah, I'm dra yeah. drafting Joss Williams, I believe, and... It's basically who I am, just trying to fight my time and not overuse my time, as I believe. Yeah. What you have to do in NASCAR Heat 5 and all these racetracks just short run, just give up a few spots, and then in the long run, when you've saved your stuff, just try to climb up the field and get to the lead from there. So, so hmm, that'll cut off the race right here, and let's see my race results. Ooh, I got a DNF. Be but because I didn't show you how I got a DNF, I kind of wrecked in the front straightaway, and I believe a rust just. Yeah. They give me compliments, but otherwise, I can just say that. Whew. Man, a DNF in my final season, but, but hey, got a, I got a few wins here and there, but I pick races in which I haven't won at, 
at that track, and Chicago Lane was one of them, along with Indy, which, well, let's go to the track and see how well I'm going to do. So here we're in Indianapolis Motor Speedway, and we're going to set our qualifying time. Let's see how I do. I'm going to skip this part and go to the... and see what my lap time is. So we're coming to the front stretch and I think it's an okay lap. Let's just wait and see. 54.115. Man, 20 seconds. That's bad. Oh well. Let's I'll hope I can get it together so I can just drive and maneuver my way through traffic. So, you have Colby Howard, Landon Castle, and Cesar Baccarella, which I believe are dropping to the back. So, I think I stay in 22nd, I believe. Yep, 22nd it is. Yeah, and I beat the guy in the inside, get the 21st, and then 20th. Man, I uh, covered the rumble strips, which is not what you should do in Indy. But anyways, let's see if I can climb, can climb my way to the field. So, I don't have anybody drafting me. Well, somebody is. Looks like that white car on the top right on my screen right there. So let's see. That will be Ray Black Jr. So as you can tell the beginning of the race was not what I hoped. Twenty second to twentieth. Which is not bad but I get through Ray Black Jr. and Brandon Brown, I believe, and I'm up to 18th, which is a solid move. So I will skip to the end of the race at around the 12 to 14 minute mark, I believe, on this video clip. So just hang around, just watch the whole race, and see what your thoughts are on it.
Okay, and we're back for another restart at the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. So, I restarted 10th and trying to get up to the lead, I believe, in my number one pilot, Flying J Chevrolet, which was driven by Michael in that last year, but however, I replaced him because he wasn't producing enough solid finishes and then. I came over from a championship, well I did win a championship at Stuart Haas Racing in the number 98 car in which Austin Center just beat, I'm telling you. And then I wanted to improve my prospects of winning again and say hopes and dreams float, float away, that's all I can say there. And I Drive down into the inside for fifth. And. Ooh. I'm not gonna just show you then. I can get the lead. I'm gonna let my hands do the talking. So that's all I can say. Okay, I'm in fifth right now and. It's not a bad run, you know. Whew. What more can I ask for? Hmm. And I get by Harrison Burton and Russ just in for third, and I do that because I really want to get the win so bad. And it's three laps to go, and both Harrison and Ross get by me. What am I doing, man? I kind of got loose right there. <laughs> Puss loose. That's what you get here in Indy if you miss your marks, you know. Hmm. <sighs> Yeah, that was kind of the reason why I lost the race. And it'll show why I didn't, you know, should have been more patient right there. And then I still get a good draft off of it. Oh, man. Why on earth did I make that move? Harrison Burton pass repasses me. <laughs> oh. What an ugly race for me. Ugh. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, I'm just seeing if I can get the second. Let's see who's in front of me. Oh man, that was an ugly move. And I'm trying to see who it is. I believe that's Ryan C. Yep, Ryan C. And a battle for a second. And let's see. And I believe that's Austin Sindrick in that 22 car. So let's see if we can chase Austin down. So we're here on turn two of Indy at Indy. Let's see if we can get for the short suit. Or in the back straight away, I believe, and... Yeah... I'm gonna just run out of time, I'm telling you. Austin Sending has a strong car, and... See how he puts up the track? That's a big no-no. And... Uh, here I am. Gonna just finish second to him. I'll sniff a draft, but that's not going to change the result right there. And I finished second, so... What more can he ask for? At least for the solid. Just the... Ugh, driver rating of 99. Not bad. So... Thank you guys for watching my Xfinity races at Chicago and Indianapolis, so... If you want to subscribe for more content, click on that bell button, give a thumbs up if you like the video so much, and comment, share your comments below the description if you 
found this vi video interesting, so gotta support me if you really love my content, so be like that, so make a happy Corona 95 and y'all have a good evening and yeah, peace out. So we're coming to the end of my YouTube video right now, so click on that thumbs up button if you like the video so much. Click on that bell button to subscribe for more content, and if you have any thoughts or feelings about the most recent YouTube video you just saw, share a comment right below the description so I can share some thoughts and feelings with others in the community and make them feel welcome. So. I'm AKA Happy Corona 957. Y'all have a great day and peace out.